Well, I, I I just need to change the timeline. Beep, 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 borp, 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 bop, bop, boop. <laughs> okay, hey everyone. Uh, oh, I didn't realize you were recording. Uh, welcome back to Press Aid Gay. <laughs> my name is Tony. My pronouns are rat <laughs> rat. <laughs> and I'm Mal, and my pronouns are beep borp. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, that was a hike. That was a lot faster than when I was 11. Easier when he was 11. Oh, we passed, what, three gates on the way up here? I lost count. Weird. Used to be open back then. Hmm. Ready to go? Not far now, just up ahead. It's a dark out. It's getting spooky. Ooh, gravestones. Graves, huh? Yeah, these were... I forget. They were involved in the Possum Massacre. That, like, labor strike thing? Where it was like the Miners vs. National Guard? Happened back in town, like, a hundred years ago. Why are they up here? I think these were some of the bad guys, and some of the miners didn't want them buried in town. Oh, huh. There's like a few old graveyards up here from like colonial times. I guess there's one up here somewhere too. Well, that's spooky. Eh, just bones. Ancient shark bones. You see, nothing left to be scary. Okay, let's see if I can get my jumping rhythm back inside of Angus. Back. Whoop, whoop. Not oh. quite, I almost got it. Wouldn't that be so annoying, someone like going at your exact pace right next to you, going <laughs> And just like jumping? Yeah, that's gonna be really annoying when I do that to you at some point in the future. <laughs> wow, we're up really high, and really far out. I can't see town from here. It's south of us, behind whatever ridge that is. So what, are we just supposed to wait here and see if anything happens? You tell me, you're the expert. I guess we'll just wait here and see if anything happens. <laughs> Wow. <laughs> nice night. Amazing. Yeah. Back at school, I couldn't see as many stars. That always made me sad. Oh, yeah. They're really nice up here. I wish I knew the constellations like you did. What? You know all the names and the stories and stuff. I wish. I can never remember them other than... I think that one up there is like a bell or something? No, 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 no. Remember that time we were all at that longest night bonfire? And we spied the constellations together? And you told us all about them? That's not a thing that happened. Oh, wow. Maybe that was like a dream or something. God, I barely remember now. I wonder what fake constellations and stories you dreamed up. Okay, humor me. I'll find the constellations you tell me about them. Okay, then. Hand mechanic. Hand mechanic. Hand mechanic. Hand mechanic. Ow. All right, find me some constellations. Wait, are these going to be real ones or fake ones? Just ones I remember. Or dreamed that one time. Ugh. Whichever. Okay, let's see. Yeah. Oh, it's a different hand. It's a see-through hand. Uh-huh. Let's do... Uh... That that looks like the Little Dipper. Wait, hold on. Wait, okay. I think there's a line drawing mechanic here. Yeah. <laughs> there we go. God, it's so poorly explained. Oh my god. You can do it. <laughs> you it's can so... draw lines. There we go. Ooh, cute. It's a cat. He's got arrows sticking out of him. And he's chasing a diamond? Oh, I know this one. Don't remember his name. He lived, uh... You remember the stories about the forest god? Yeah. Sure. My granddad used to tell me Adina stories. Oh, okay, yeah. Anyway, this cat was in there. Like, shiny things, was good at getting through the forest, was really good at stealing. Oh, wow, yeah, I used to call him Ass Cat when I was little. Well, then he stole a diamond from a king and got arrowed to death. But he was slick enough that he jumped out of his body and became immortal or something. Huh, decent. Extremely decent. Wow. Oh, and here's my hand again. Hand canic! Okay, so... I'm gonna see how far I can stretch this mechanic. God, this is this is not like any of the other hand mechanics. Hand mechanic. Oh no, those those ones just straight up don't connect. They don't want to connect together. Oh no, I yep, think we got a Tony. triangle. Yep. You what? Sorry, Tony. Right. <laughs> yeah, sorry, Tony. <laughs> you gotta connect them right. Okay, that's a bell, and in the middle is this eye, looking at you. Okay, that's a. 
I know this one a little from like prog rock album covers. Um, I think you die when it rings when it's looking at you. Well, crap. It's high up enough, it's kind of always looking at all of us, right? God damn. <laughs> oh, okay, I guess that's it. Wee. I mean, this would, you know, if Wee. I was on a mouse, I could see this being noticeably better. Yeah. Okay, no, I think I gotta go here. Boing, nope. nope. No, I gotta go down? Nope. Gotta go over to that one. Gotta go yeah, fast. Yeah, I gotta go fast. Okay. Got like this a... one's gonna be like a possum. With I... the cute nose. No. Nope. No, it's a whale with mountains on it. It's a whale, and it's got like the world on its back. Oh wow, that's sad. Why? Why does it have to carry the whole world? Like, that's really unfair. Haha, uh -huh. yeah. That is legitimately upsetting. You gotta wonder why people made these up. I mean, like, these specifically. Who saw a whale and was like, needs to be carrying something? I mean, whales are pretty big. They didn't know what the Earth was. Yeah, but like, I don't assume everything I don't understand is a whale. You could start. In the hand. <laughs> I mean, I guess. I guess we could start. Doing. Doing. Oh, we got a big one here. Yep. It's gonna be beautiful. Coming in hot. This one's gonna be a possum. Damn it. It's a bird. It's a pope. He breathes fire. Oh, this one is real. Or at least the dude is. Rubello. There's a statue of him outside church. Oh, we never went there. Uh. <laughs> do you not know your saints at all? <laughs> nah, none of my family were into it. My saints were all like, uh, astronauts and authors. That sounds funny, or really funny. Eh. My mom works up at the church now. I haven't gone really since I was like 14 or 15. Does she mind? She pretends not to. Give me oh. the hand. Oh, we're like way out here, huh? In the park? Yeah, I guess. Spooky. I don't know. It's pretty safe. And the stars are pretty. So you don't believe in ghosts at all? Nah, don't believe in ghosts or gods. Or psychic powers or anything like that. Not at all? I mean, there's no evidence for them and people have really tried. Did you ever? Yeah, when I was a kid. Tell me about it. So, um... I don't know how much I've ever told you or how much Greg has told you. But I didn't have the best childhood. Oh. Yeah, I think I heard that. Why was it bad? Um, my dad didn't like me. And my mom didn't either. And like, um... You don't have to talk about it if you don't want to. No, it's fine. Um, my dad used to hit me a lot. And my mom was probably worse. Like, wouldn't feed me. Which is why I really like cooking now, haha. <laughs> She'd like, shove me into the pantry and slam the door really hard. Wow, this is so upsetting. Yeah. And all the stuff would fall off the shelves on top of me. Oh my god, Angus. I didn't know at all. That's awful. She'd lock me in there for like a day at a time sometimes, or overnight. So I'd like try to develop psychic powers so I could like signal the neighbors or unlatch the door. Didn't work as you might guess. Oh man. Did you ever tell anybody? I never did. I don't know why. After a while, I, like, started feeling guilty, too, for some reason. Like, this was something bad I was doing? Like, being abused? Angus, that's not your fault at all. You were a kid. Oh, don't worry. I know that now. Boy, do I ever. Question. Can I go kick all of their asses? Like, I've got experience. I can F some shit up. Well, my mom is kind of old now. I, uh, still have to visit her sometimes. I have a brother, he's overseas in the army, and my dad left like 10 years ago, so who knows where he is or if he's even alive. He is alive, I don't want to know about it. Angus, I just want to give you a hug forever. Haha, <laughs> well, I was luckier than a lot of kids. I'm just glad I didn't like, yeah. Anyway, to your original question. Uh, testing out my psychic abilities in the pantry made me really interested in both paranormal stuff and science. And I joined a skeptic society on the internet, and that kind of ruined me on a lot of other supernatural bullshit. And it gave me something to solve. Something you could debunk or know. I don't know. It saved me a little bit, I guess. Because when someone does all that stuff to you, it can, like, make you do some bad things to yourself. But anyway, yeah. No ghosts are God. So, like... 
I feel like if I had been through that, I'd be more likely to want to believe in God or something. Do you believe in anything at all? Um, well, so like, the constellations. I don't believe there's a whale out there. But I, uh, believe that the stars exist, and that people put the whale there. Like, I don't know. We're good at drawing lines through the spaces between stars. Like, we're pattern finders, and we'll find patterns, and we, like, really put our hearts and minds into it. And even if we don't mean to. So I believe in a universe that doesn't care, and people who do. Pattern finders. I feel like a lot of people don't think they found God, but, like, God found them. Like, when they were having bad times like you did. God never did. I was completely alone in the pantry. But a few years later, Greg did. So like, stars can stay up there and not give a shit about us. But this whale is pretty cool. You're an extremely good and smart person, Angus. I try. But I'm no more than anyone else. I don't believe that, Angus. Yep. Yep. I should come out here more often. Haha. <laughs> yeah. Don't look at him. Who? There's someone standing behind us, in the trees. Holy shit! Holy shit! What do they look like? Tall, wearing some kind of weird coat. Like a utility coat or something? Oh god, that's the ghost. I'm more worried about it being a living person, standing in the woods, staring at us. Oh god, oh god. Well, don't panic. Follow my lead. Hey there! Out for a hike? Nice night. <laughs> Creepy. He's not answering. That's a little hostile, right? That's definitely a little hostile. Hey! I know what you did. Mate, no. I saw you. Okay, well, we're gonna run now. We need to get out. We need to get to the car. But your asthma. I got an inhaler. The good kind, too. No one in heaven <laughs> or earth can stop me. <laughs> okay, okay, let's go. Deep breaths. In, out. All right. <laughs> 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 they just kind of go past our buddy. Yep. <laughs> yeah, okay. Wow. There is a spooky buddy. Oh, spooky graves. Well, no, no. Wait, are you reading dialogue that's not there? No. <laughs> oh, shoot. Oh, we're being chased. Oh, we're being chased. <laughs> what? <laughs> Why? Because I was being halting? Yeah, because you were being halting. <laughs> Wheeze. Are you okay, Mal? <laughs> oh, it's the game. Okay. Yes. Wheeze. Are you okay, Mal? Shut up, Tony. <laughs> you okay, big guy? Oh, I want somebody to call me big guy. Yeah, I'll be okay <laughs> in a few minutes. I'm resilient. So that was it. That was the ghost. Or Wheeze. It was Wheeze, some weirdo who lives out here. They probably get lots of kids throwing parties back there. I mean, the party we went to where he threw up. Ugh. That wasn't too far from there. Ugh. Why does nobody believe me? Me, it's like every other explanation is more likely than ghost. Okay, fine, whatever. Sorry. Grouchy. Headache. That was scary. It's cool. It was. Wow. Wow. Ghosty. So I imagine we're gonna see either little bits kinda like that in our various yeah, things. Yeah, little bits. Thought Angus is psychic, but his hat blocks it. Oh snap! Charming. <laughs> oh. Not gonna talk to the family. I really like that we're like, I don't know, I just really like all these characters. I don't know. I keep Mal, learning are you more suggesting that you them. enjoy this? Yeah, I am enjoying this, actually. I like it a lot. Uh. See, this is one of those games where you don't have to actually be good at playing games. Oh, yeah. No, no. I no, I appreciate it. In fact, I'm actually kind of enjoying it right now, too. Good. Hey, Bea, are you awake? I very much am. Doing bills and eating a grilled cheese. What's up? Went to the park with Angus. How'd it go? It was fun until it was scary. How so? We totally saw the ghost in the woods. Really? Angus saw this? He did. Wow, okay. Hold on. I'm texting Angus. Why? Angus is an annoyingly strident atheist. He doesn't believe in ghosts. Why can't you just take my word for it? Hold on. Or we're holding. Can't move. <laughs> He said it was probably a hunter. Ugh. Okay, whatever. Sorry, for what it's worth, I don't not believe you. Thanks. You have a good time otherwise? Yeah, I learned a lot about Angus. He's had kind of a rough life. Oh yeah, he definitely has. 
Wait, how did you know about this? Uh, because Angus and I have been friends since like eighth grade. Oh, yeah, I forgot. You're not like the glue holding us all together. Angus kind of is. He's the common denominator. Me and Greg don't hang out. Hmm, Angus is good. He is. Okay, I'm going to sleep. TTYL. What does that stand for? Talk to you later. I'm sorry, what? Talk to you later. Oh, okay. <laughs> hey, hey, hey. Yo, yo, yo. Hey, hey. Did you and Angus have a good time? Uh, let's see here. Yeah, it was great until it was super scary. You guys saw a weird creepo, huh? Yeah, it was the effing ghost again. Hold on. <laughs> Angus is thinking it was a hunter. Bug season starts in like two days. Oh, what the hell? Put him on. Okay, 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 okay. Is he going to show his text color? Oh. Hey, <laughs> hey Mae, this is Angus. Dude, you saw him with your own eyes. I mean, we saw a guy who was being weird. There are folks that live up there in the park, and there are hunting camps and stuff. So it was most likely a guy out hunting buck early. Dude, I like felt it. I know. I don't know what to say about that. I think all three of us were very spooked. Okay, fine. Thanks for being going and being brave and stuff. Anytime. I had fun. You can put Greg back on. <laughs> this is just like real life. <laughs> hey, 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 dude. I'm an artiste. Were you doing art just now? Sure was. All right, off to bed. Night, dude. Uh, hey, uh, May, this is Greg. You and Angus are talking on my computer. Oh, hey, I'm Angus. I'm so smart and have a great ass. Blah, 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 blah. You two are talking a lot. Hold on, I'm drawing him a dirty message in a paint <laughs> program. It's a dick with his hat on it and a smiley face. I don't know what it even means. Looks like you two are wrapping up. Peace out, yo. Hey, May, it's Angus. <laughs> you and Greg are talking. I can attest that this picture is kind of baffling. Good night. <laughs> Amazing. That was silly. Oh, oh shit. Hi. 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 I, oh, I love it. Oh, oh, I kind of want to play this game here, but I also want to finish this LP. Okay, how the yeah, fuck do I leave again? Uh, You click that. No, you don't click that. Oh, God. You B? do that. I, I hit the B button. I yeah. hit the back button. The back button. The button that takes you back. Well, not the back. Well, uh, so I'm using a 360 controller right now, and there is, in fact, a back button. I don't know why they ever called it a back button. That's it's not. weird. Yes, it is bedtime. All right. So we're going to have to pay careful attention to the morning, whatever. Mm -hmm. Oh, God. Are we going to have another dream sequence? Are Probably. we seriously going to have a dream sequence every fucking night? I, I mean, I don't know. Maybe, maybe not. Uh, this one seems different, though. Uh, okay. Wow, I can't see anything that's happening. Oh, there it goes. Yeah, I appreciate that it's maybe a little different. <sighs> I mean, I would assume so after we just saw a weird old spookum. I guess so. The gravity's a little weirder. A little fluffier. You're <laughs> I love fluffy gravity. Yeah. It's so... So we live in Fluffy. Seattle, and um, sometimes during the late winter, gravity gets a little fluffier here. Oh yeah, it gets a little fluffy. Which is pretty interesting. Mm -hmm. uh, also, interesting enough, uh, not in Seattle, but just a little further up north in Bellevue, uh, our time zone is different than uh, Wait, uh, than north all the rest in of the Bellevue, or do you mean north in Bellingham? That's what I said. Uh, our our time zones are a bit different around here mm -hmm. um, than thing than in California, which is odd because it's supposed Whoa. to be the same time zone. Uh huh. That's a weird. A weird non anthropomorphic cat. Hello? Uh, can you talk? Yes. For some reason, you're the first thing here I've thought to talk to. Yes. It's probably because I'm a weird giant cat. <laughs> Are you God? No. Oh. <laughs> so. Seconds ago, little creatures are coming. And they are asking if I am God, and I am asking what God is, and they are telling me, and I am not this God, and this God is nowhere. Uh, well that's where faith comes in, I guess. Little creatures are explaining faith, and moments ago is the beginning, and I am here then and here now, and there is nowhere for God to be hiding. Hmm. So what am I doing here? Monstrous existence. No, I mean, what am I doing here? What are you? What are those other giant animals? Have I been seeing ghosts? They were like bits of the world. I think I was on a train, but it was like a town. It's all... Ugh, I lost it. Okay, so... A great beast is walking through the sands, and they are climbing into the air. And now they are making a tear, and now they are gone. 
and now you are here. A tear? With their hooves. <laughs> They're making a tear. Little creatures are wandering through the air, and they are dragging in places and echoes of lives. And they are asking me about God. My head hurts. I am going to tell you something, little creature. You are swimming further and further out to sea, and beyond are things blind and terrible. And I am showing you now. Oh. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Spooky. Eldritch shit. Amazing. I'm into it. Yeah, I like Eldritch shit. Um, but it's odd that you're into it, because you usually don't like that stuff. Shut up, Tony. Uh, oh my god. I'm, no, I'm no. literally one of the great old ones. <laughs> oh, I see. Oh god, oh god. They are blind, but they are seeing you, and you are coming to them. After this, you are not returning here. I am climbing into the air and closing the sky. Uh, why? I am tired of speaking with little creatures. I am tired of speaking of God. Okay. I will tell you a second thing. There is a hole at the center of everything, and it is always growing. Between the stars I am seeing it. It is coming. And the camera is zooming. And you are not escaping. And the universe is forgetting you. And the universe is being forgotten. And there is nothing to remember it. Not even the things beyond. And now there is only the hole. So does anything mean anything? This is not a question worth answering. Uh, what about my home? What about my friends? Soon they are dying. Soon they are rotting. You are atoms. And your atoms are not caring if you are existing. Your atoms are monstrous existence. Why am I here, goddammit? Why was I chosen to see all this? Where is this going? Little creature, you are not chosen. There is no one to choose you. This is going nowhere. We are not meeting again. And the universe is forgetting you. And I am remembering you. But not because I am caring. The beginning is moments ago. The end is moments away. There is no time to forget before all is forgotten. Goodbye, little creature. Okay. Interesting. I I guess? Meh. I mean, I guess... Okay, okay. No, I just don't see how any of that Meh. means anything. I'm assuming that means nothing. Like, unless they actually go there with the plot, which I would be ecstatic if they actually went somewhere really fucking weird with the plot. But That would be cool. I'm into it. I want but, it. I want it to happen. I really doubt that's gonna happen. No, I think it's gonna. I don't think. I false. Tony, I'm tired <laughs> of I, talking to little creatures. No. <laughs> no. Okay. I want to talk to all the little creatures. Well, I also want to see what the fuck this animation is of her pulling it out. Yeah, I don't know what it is. I don't know either. Well, we just got echoes. God, you know, I actually don't know how to turn off that steam overlay. <laughs> Uh, okay. The sturm overlay. Uh, the falafel. The okay. malafel. So, anyone to talk to down here? Let's see here. Can your, I talk to my mom? Your ma'am? Yeah, your we'll talk to my mom. That's probably a good idea. Staring at each other. Honey, you okay? Ugh, mornings are tough right now. Are you pregnant? No. Oh, honey, is that why you came home? No, not at all. Sweetie, you can tell me. I've been there. And despite nature's intentions, God came through and blessed us with you. You are a miracle, baby. That's me, a miracle. After all the miscarriages, we'd given up hope. And then there you were. And here I am now. So if you're pregnant... I'm not pregnant. It was in a, I was not in a situation where pregnancy happens. Okay, okay. I just want you to know that you can always come to us with this. Okay, noted. Can we talk about anything else? Sure. Oh. <laughs> Look at the little leg kicks. Yep. You know, if you did have a baby... Okay, I'm out. <laughs> okay, sweetie. I'm sorry, I get excited about grandbabies. It's fine. I'll be back later. Love you. I love you too. Aw, thanks, uh, Tony. Uh, uh, oh, I mean, yeah, you know, I think it's important to, like, show a level of, like, animosity with your co-hosts. <gasps> <laughs> Not animosity. <laughs> the other the other one. <sighs> hey, I like you can jump on this shit. Yeah. No, you can. I didn't know you could jump on the signposts. All right. I, th I think you. Oh no, I did know because we did that, and then you go up here. Yep. Correct. Shit. Actually, I don't even Correct. care. Correct. Go. Run. Run. All right. So are we doing <laughs> Bay or Greg next? Ooh. Okay. Well, Greg is the historical society, and Bay is the graveyard, right? 
I feel like we basically just did a graveyard, so let's do yeah, Greg. Yeah, so let's do Greg. I agree. Save the graveyard for last. Save the Baya for last. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm also kind of amazed that this game actually seems to be taking place over the course of, say, a month or so. Or longer. Uh... I mean, yeah, possibly. Like, it's, are it's we gonna kind play of ambiguous. Every day of the month? Like, are we going to wake up for 30 Photoshop, days? Photoshop. Maybe more. Uh, I'm not really sure. Oh my god, every single fucking time, Tony. What? Photoshop. What? Oh my god. Okay, so so we're going for, the uh, old for Bea. Not, oh, wait, no, no, no. So do, we do want the old pickaxe. No, no, no. That's where Bea is. We're not going to Bea. We're going oh, to Oh, all right, all right. I, I, Wow, Tony, we we literally just decided this like ten seconds ago. <laughs> this is true, and if if you uh, and we would be really glad if you decided to watch the next episode <laughs> of Night in the Woods. So everyone, uh, thanks for watching, and we'll see you later. Bye. Goodbye, little creatures. Goodbye, little creatures. <laughs>